Greetings, my beautiful brothers and sisters. I am so honored to be here right now, sharing this moment with all of you celebrating Africana. My name is TJ Travis. I'm an Afro-Indigenous artist descended from travelers of the Underground Railroad. Their ancestors come from across oceans on the backs of waves. I am the son of Terence, who's the son of Leslie, who's the son of Henry, who's the son of John, who's the son of Richard, ancestors of moon and stars, suns and constellations. And we were all connected by the beautiful gift of our creator, vibration, drum. It's such a pleasure for me to be able to share share in this moment with uh, with everybody even if we're doing it in this in this virtual way you know because we're going to connect you know within a very important existence and that is the existence of rhythm <clears throat> now first and first and foremost you know I, I'd like to say you know the uh, the drum, the drum that I'm holding in my hands right now, this drum was, 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 was gently and excitedly named by the children in our neighborhood. And the children in our neighborhood, they call this, they call this drum, banana. Banana. Banana is a drum that travels with me in and out of classrooms, reaching out to people of all generations. So I'm very excited to be. Uh, sharing this moment with you, having having banana between the two of us to bring alive those those sounds. Now, <clears throat> what we're what we're really here for is we're really here for for a celebration. We're really here to uh, you know to move to move our shoulders a little bit, to dance our dance our feet a little bit, to feel good, right? To feel good with each other. You know, so I'm gonna get us started just by playing a little bit of this drum, but what my hope is that in this kicking off of Africana, celebration of Africana, you know, all of our peoples, all of us related, all of us connecting, all of us sharing that love, that understanding, that compassion, that togetherness, building blocks, building blocks, you know, getting better together, moving up, moving up, moving up. And we do that with the, uh, with the rhythm that is born in the blood that moves through our bodies, that makes our bone shake, that connects us in such a positive way you know so when i look at my drum my drum teachers have taught me that the center of the drum where the bass lives this is our heartbeat and that heartbeat is also a representation of our of our elders and our ancestors collectively giving us the deepness that we need to carry us through the uh the hardest of times so we can celebrate our triumphs you know, tracking over top of our, our trials to get to our triumphs. So we have that, that stillness, that powerful, that beat, that heartbeat, the center of that drum, the center of that drum, so powerful, bringing us all together. And that exists right in the center of our drum. Now what we have on the outside of our drum, what I refer to as tone, tone, tone. That's the outside of the drum, and that's where we live. All of us who are living, all of us who are learning, all of us who are getting better as we go, learning how to connect, learning how to put things into a perspective that elevates us to the highest level so we can do the greatest honor to, to our creator. That's the tone. That's the children. That's the adolescents. That's the young adults. That's the older adults. That those are the almost elder adults. Not quite there yet, but we like to move. We like to be playful. We like to dance. We're curious. We're quick. But it all comes back to our ancestors and our elders bringing us all the way back down with their wisdom and their understanding. And that wisdom and the understanding is that heartbeat drum. That heartbeat drum. Now, when I travel from school to school and I'm introducing children to the drum, uh, five-year-olds, seven-year-olds, nine-year-olds, all the way up to uh, adolescents, what I teach them is bass, boom, bass, boom. 
We are all connected together forever within our vibration, in our rhythm, in our storytelling, you know? So one of the rhythms I like to share with them is bass to tone, tone, bass, bass, tone, tone, bass, tone, tone, bass, bass, tone, tone, bass, tone, tone, bass, bass, tone, tone. And sometimes we take that rhythm, we put a little accent on it. And instead of bass to tone, tone, bass, bass, tone, tone, it turns into bass, tone to tone, bass, bass, tone, tone, bass, tone, 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 bass, bass, tone, tone, bass, tone, tone, bass, bass, tone, tone, bass, tone, tone, bass, tone, bass, bass, tone, tone, bass, tone, tone, bass, tone, bass, bass, tone, tone, 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 this is a rhythm that you can bring to any continent on this planet. You can sit down, play that rhythm, and you will fit into any drum circle because drummers understand togetherness, understand life, understand universal energy, rep understand faithfulness, understand creation, understand why we're here. And that's to build together to get to the next level. So when we come together in our drum circle, right? And I'm hoping that some of y'all right now have a have a drum close to you. I hope that you have a, maybe a small percussion instrument next to you. If you don't have something to play, I hope you got your hands to clap. If you have the ability, you got your fingers to snap. And if you uh, really start to feel it in your body, you can stomp your feet a little bit. You know, so what we should really do right now, you know, just to kick off this celebration of Africana is we should... Clap your hands, clap your hands, snap your fingers. Clap your hands, clap your hands, clap your hands, clap your hands, your hands. snap your fingers. Now play that bass. Now play that bass. If you got a drum, play that bass. If you got a drum, play that bass. If you got a shaker, shake your shaker. Shake your shaker. Shake your shaker. Or clap your hands. Just clap your hands. And snap your fingers. And snap your fingers. If you got a drum, you're gonna play the bass. You're gonna play the bass. You're gonna play the bass. Now bass, bass, and clap, clap, and snap, snap, and clap, clap, and snap, snap, and clap, clap, and play your bass. Come on, now play your bass. Now I know we got some dancers out there that are listening right now. You might be standing up. You might be sitting down. Doesn't matter which one you're doing. You can stomp your feet. You can play your bass or stomp your feet. You can play your bass or stomp your feet. You can play your bass or clap your hands or snap your fingers and stomp your feet or stomp your feet. Now play your bass and stomp your feet and snap your fingers or clap your hands play your bass and stomp your feet you can snap your fingers and clap your hands i'm gonna count down from three and then you're going to jam with me three two one and jam play
three, two, one, jam. Three, two, one, clap your hands, 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 snap your fingers, snap your fingers, come on, snap your fingers, snap your fingers, come on, snap your fingers. Snap your fingers, come on, snap your fingers, snap your fingers, come on, clap, clap, snap, snap, clap, clap, snap, 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 clap, clap, snap, snap, clap, clap, snap, snap, snap. out into the camera and I'm trying to see all of y'all trying to see which one y'all are dancing trying to make sure everybody is smiling make sure everyone is having fun Everybody take a minute and just rub out your hands, gently stretch out your fingers, yeah, just like that. You know, when I was when I was a kid, they taught us this little trick to do this with our hands. Y'all can do this thing? When I go into the into the classrooms, especially with the kindergartners, you know, we like to uh like to do that little little trick and then watch the kids try to figure it out. They say, oh, open up your hands. Move your fingers, put your hands together, down, and then turn it out. Yeah. You know, bunch, bunch of fun. We like to have fun. And the beautiful thing about the drum is it brings us together for fun. Now, for me, there's many, 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 many different uh, stories, stories around the drum. You know, depending on who your drum teacher is, depending on where their uh, where the origin of their story comes from, right? But uh, for me, you know, the stories that have come come to me is you know I recognized uh, this this drum, you know, which was uh, 
made with the uh, made with the hands of uh, beautiful, beautiful Mali. Uh, we uh, we 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 consider this to be, you know, the celebration drum, you know. And we look at we look at djembe, the word djembe, as you know, to to come together, to bring people together. And that's what we're uh, that's what we're here doing doing today, right now. You know, we've come together in celebration of ourselves. You know, I'm here to celebrate you. I'm here to celebrate me. We're here to celebrate we. You know, we're kicking it off with the rhythm. You know, just as our ancestors did, just as we do, just as our children will do after us, and just as their children will do after them. You know, we go and come together with these drums. This is one of the most powerful devices of communication. You know, if I want to express an emotion to you, if I'm feeling good, if I'm feeling good, I'm gonna I'm gonna come with you with some party with some party music. You know what I'm saying? And we're gonna come together and we're gonna celebrate and it's gonna sound like That's a drum that's saying, here we are. We here to celebrate whatever that celebration is, you know, is it is it a wedding? Is it a birthday? You know, is it a uh, graduated from university? You know, we celebrating, we feeling real good about ourselves because I tell you what, we're survivors. You know what I'm saying? Like I said earlier in the video, I am the descendant of Underground Railroad travelers. And what that means is I'm the is I'm the descendant of previously enslaved people and when I'm talking about people who survived the 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 the, the worst conditions of humanity you know the uh, the the worst blemishes on our history as human beings fell upon our ancestors and I am the living proof that we can overcome we can overcome you know so in that overcoming the drum is there you know right we have ancestors that came from on the other side of the ocean, carrying this rhythm with them, you know, and through the generations, that drum has landed in different hands, in different places, and been influenced in different ways. You know, we listen to the radio today and we enjoy our our, our hip hop, our R and B, rhythm and blues, right? Soul music. That soul music came from somewhere. That soul music came from the earth. This drum comes from the earth, you know. So. What I like to share with the, the young people that I work with, I say, you see, this drum right here, this drum right here is a powerful device of communication that carries the stories of ancestors that go back as old as the sun, the vibration of, of, of light, the creation of matter. You look up into the sky, you see stars, constellations. Every once in a while, you can peek in and you can see a planet out there. That's this vibration. That's this thing that we're all created with under the umbrella and the supervision of our great, great creator. You know, so this is this is very this is very important. And when my heart doesn't feel so good and I need to express sorrow, I can put that into my drum and it might sound something like. And that's the march of a troubling time. And that's the march of a troubling time that brought us over hills, through valleys to get to the place where we are today. And I'll tell you right now, the place we are today, we're in a place where I can connect with the motherland through my sisters and brothers who have come from the continent into North America carrying culture bringing us together to, 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 to celebrate in this, this Africana, celebrating in this Africana. I can go outside right now and I can just roam around this city and I can find so many people from the motherland that represent different areas, different cultures, different sounds, different colors. It's beautiful, pure beauty. And I can do all of that through this drum, through this drum. I can sit in anybody's festival with my drum and I can listen to their music and then I can bring my music and then we can make music together. The same thing works in conversation. 
I can bring my story, my experiences to the table to be heard, to be appreciated. And I can do the same thing for someone else. You know, I'd love to learn everything. I love to learn what people have to say, people's stories. Stories are so important, and that's the tapestry that binds us all together. And it's beautiful. And when we sit around in a circle, and we have our drums, and we're sharing in conversation, we're sharing in sounds, we're, we're drumming up the rhythm of this sacred instrument, this beautiful sacred instrument that carries so much energy in it. It's amazing. You know, and it's my goal to express that excitement to young people so they can get excited about this, about this instrument, about the, the history of this instrument story. You know what I'm saying? Like this drum, this beautiful drum, these beautiful carvings that come from somebody's hand. This beautiful drum that is carved out of one piece of wood. Look at this, the engineering that goes into this, and this is old technology. This is old technology that exists today. You know, so when we hold on to this drum, we have to be sure that we are mindful of the person whose hands created this drum. The skill, the effort, the beauty, the poetry of this constructed, wonderful, magnificent piece of art. We also have to be mindful of the tree. The, this is a plantation mahogany tree. This tree fell and lives now through this drum. You look at the top of this drum, you know what we got here? This is a goat hide. We have a goat hide at the top of this drum. So when we play this drum, you also got to keep in mind that we are in tune and connected to the spirit of the animal that lays across this drum. So when we play this drum, although we play this drum to have fun, to celebrate, to communicate, we also have to be mindful of the energy of the tree, the energy and the sacrifice of the goat and the skill of the drum maker. All of that stuff in one beautiful work of art. And that, re that reminds me of me and it reminds me of you and the way that we are also these beautiful spiritually drawn beings created in perfection to communicate, to build, to share, to carry stories. Now, I wanna bring us back again with a little bit of that finger snapping and a little bit of that hand clapping and a little bit of that foot stomping. And if the spirit moves you, I want you to get up and I want you to dance. I want you to get up and I want you to dance. But before we get into our rhythm, before we get into our rhythm, let's check out the, the important voice of our drum. All the different sounds that we find inside our drum. We know we have our bass. And we know that the bass is an expression of our elders and our ancestors, you know, keeping us in line, keeping us in tune, keeping us on that path, that good path that leads us to that good place, to that other place that's beyond, that's beyond this physical round of existence. We know that's what this bass does. We know that's what this heartbeat does. And we know that's where our elders are. And we know that's the plane where we can visit our ancestors inside that bass. And now we got that, now we got that tone. And we know that tone is where we live. We know that tone is the uh, is 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 where we connect. That's our frequency. When I play that, when I play that tone, that's me connecting with you. That's me speaking your language. That tone is your language. That tone is your heartbeat. That tone is your spirit. That tone is your dreams. That tone is your aspirations. That tone is your inspiration. That tone is our peace. That tone is our peace. And when we bring it together, we can be at peace under the supervision of the ancestors. You feel me? You dig that? We can be playful. You know, when I work with these kids, you know, oftentimes we create what we call soundscapes. And for those of us who might not know what a soundscape is, that's when we create a story just using sound. 
you know, and then we can add some words to it later. You know, and for the sake of this short video, I'll bring words to it now, but imagine we are just, we're walking, we're walking through the forest. Walking through the forest. We can hear the wind going through the trees. The wind's going through the trees. We got squirrels and chipmunks running about, running about. Shoot, they're just out there trying to feed themselves. These squirrels and these chipmunks, they're just trying to make a life like we're trying to make a life. Ain't nothing wrong with that. And they're living underneath the shadows of these big masterful trees. These big masterful trees that move with the wind, that move with the wind. You know, and every once and again, you're gonna have some raindrops. The rain's gonna fall sometimes. That good water, that water's life. It's gonna land on the ground, it's gonna sprout plants. It's gonna, screw, it's gonna sprout plants that are gonna provide us with medicine. It's gonna provide us with fruit. Everything we need is provided for us inside this landscape. We're blessed. We are truly blessed. And if you don't know that you're blessed, you will one day. You can't get away from it. Every time we, every time our body breathes in and breathes out and we're not even thinking about it, we're blessed. We wake up in the morning, we're blessed. We connect with each other, we're blessed. We dance in the rain, we're blessed. We feel the snow upon our nose, we're blessed. We feel the sun on our face, we're blessed. We travel from A to Z, we're blessed. Many of us who are watching right now, we've, we've already circumnavigated this planet. We've already seen everything. We know that we are and that our ancestors were the original. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Afro-indigenous, moon, sun, stars, music, creator of color, inventor of personality, technology, mathematics, science. Look up into the sky, read those constellations, astronomy, astrology. That's our people. That's what we're here to celebrate. That's what we're here to celebrate. So let me count down that three, two, one, and clap your hands, everybody. Clap your hands. Clap your hands, everybody. Clap your hands. Now, if you're really feeling confident, you can double it up. You know how we do in church, like this. Snap your fingers. Just snap your fingers. Snap your fingers. All right. Snap your fingers. All right. Snap your fingers. Can you feel it? You feel good? I'm going to count down three, two, one, and play your drum.
playful that tone is, that's our spirit. We just dancing like we inside a circus. We ain't worried about nothing. Because we know who we are. We know where we're headed. We can see our blessings. sisters and brothers, elders and youngsters, take a nice deep breath in and release. Oh yeah, get loose, get loose, get loose. Nothing wrong with it, nothing wrong with it. Get your head loose, get your head loose, get your head loose. See what I'm saying? Get yourself a nice stretch, a nice stretch because this is just the kickoff for what's going to be an amazing time. We're going to collaborate. We're going, we're going to build. It's going to be beautiful. It's going to be beautiful. Now, today, moving forward through this program, all the important things we've been doing in the past collectively to support each other, everything we're going to do in the future. Everything we're going to do in the future. If you are an elder right now, if you are, if you are a, a senior adult, if you're a young adult, I want you to look at the children in the room. If those children are in the room, make eye contact with those children. I want you to be able to see the dreams and the possibility that is in those children's eyes. And I want you to use the wisdom and the strength and the experience that you hold inside your eyes to plant the seeds that they need to move them into the next square. Because the future is bright. The future is bright. I want to thank y'all for uh, hanging out with me, for letting me share my drum with you, for letting me share my story with you. I want y'all to know how proud I am of you, how much I look up to you. I want you to know how much faith I have in you and how I can't wait to see y'all just continue to rise. Just continue to rise. Continue to rise, continue to rise, continue to rise. Now, if you have a drum, I want you to put your hands on the tone of your drum. If you have a shaker, I want you to hold your shaker. If you don't, if you don't have a shaker or a drum, but you have your hands, I want you to put your hands together. I want you to stomp your feet. I want you to snap your fingers because we are bringing it all the way up. new world. Y'all sisters and brothers, y'all stay peace. Y'all count your blessings and share that drum. Share that spirit. Share that love. Share that light. And always remember, no matter what, no matter what anybody might tell you, no matter what may have been planted into your mind, you are beautiful. You are strong. Everything comes from you and through you. You are the divine light of the creator. And anything you think you can manifest. We are success. One love. Peace. <laughs>